Hey, so I'm back. I'm here to do the taste test reviews of the uh, of the food that I showed you in the last video. And let's just get started. So first up is the Coles Italian tuna salad. Um, this does not need to be heated or anything. Um, and its nutritional value is actually fairly decent. Uh, calories 200, total fat 7 grams, sodium 460 milligrams, carbs 19 grams, protein 17 grams. Um, this was comes with a little fork spoon thing. Um, this was actually surprisingly tasty. It looked like crap. Um, horrible color, nothing at all like the photo. Um, but the texture was actually fine and the taste was pretty decent. It had really large chunks of tuna. Um, and I'd definitely buy this again to have in my pantry for emergency meals. Um, there's one of the large chunks of tuna. But I'd also like I, but I'd also like buy it to take to work for lunch because um, it actually tasted that good. I mean, um, you know, for looking as crappy as it did. Um, next up was a Loma Linda meal, uh, tikka masala, uh, vegan. Uh, now, I want to note that for this one, it's actually two servings in that little packet. I really hate how companies do this. Um, and for that reason alone, I will never buy another Loma Linda product. Um, because I think it's extremely false advertising because this amount of food in this packet would in no way equate to two meals for, um, you know, or a meal for two people. So basically you've got to look at everything. Calories 124 times 2, 248. Fat 3 grams times 2, 6 grams. Sodium 420 milligrams times 2, 840 milligrams. Carbs, 19 grams times two is 38 grams of carbs. Protein, only a mere five grams times two, which is 10, 10 grams. <clears throat> um, the flavor was okay, but not great. It was uh, slightly spicy, but not like hot spicy. Um, overall, it was edible, but I would not buy it again. Um, not only just because the whole false packaging, which I consider false packaging, um, but it just wasn't good enough to ever have to eat again. So it didn't look any better heated up than it did before it was heated. Um, anyway. Next up is the Nutrisystem Penne Chicken Margarita. Um, calories 190, total fat 5 grams, sodium 500 grams, carbs 25 grams, protein 11 grams. Um, this pasta was okay, um, not too mushy, considering it's a prepackaged pasta. Uh, the chicken was all dark meat, which I actually love dark meat, it certainly has more flavor, and it's usually a whole lot more tender. Uh, but this was sort of chewy, <laughs> uh, a weird, a weird sort of chewy for chicken. Um, I don't know if it was like extremely overcooked, um, which might be the case, you know, as it was packaged. I don't know. Um, overall, though, it had a decent flavor. I'd buy it again uh, to have as an emergency pantry item, but I wouldn't buy it to take to work for lunch. I mean, I can make much better chicken margarita at home. <laughs> Um, that I know exactly what's in it um, and I do and it ends up being you know I end up always having leftovers anyway so cats acting crazy here <clears throat> it did at least look fairly decent um, again you can see it's dark meat said kind of chewy so that was a bit bizarre
So next up is the Loma Linda again, uh, and this is the Italian Bolognese. Again, multiply everything on the nutritional value chart by two, because this is supposed to be two servings, but there is no way it would serve two people. Um, so calories total would be 262, fat 6 grams, sodium 966 grams, carbs 38 grams, protein 14 grams. Um, I could not even eat this. It was way too spicy for me. I don't understand why bolognese would be hot spicy. It shouldn't be. Um, I don't know what they put in it, um, but I only ate about four bites of this and I could not eat any more. Um, so I went hungry for lunch that day. Oh, and the pasta was like mushy. Not horribly bad mushy, but mushy. Next up is the Nutrisystem, the other Nutrisystem one I got, which is the Penne Chicken Alfredo. I was really worried about this, if you remember from my last video, about it being really watery and just nasty. Um, calories 200, total fat 8 grams, sodium 490 milligrams, carbs 18 gram, grams, protein 16 grams. Um, the pasta was okay, it was not too mushy. Um, the chicken texture in this was better, it was not... Um, as, as chewy as the uh, margarita. It actually had a decent amount of chicken to pasta ratio. Um, and if you go back uh, to the uh, margarita, I think it only had f 12, 11 grams of protein, and this has got 16 grams of protein. So that makes sense uh, that this had a lot of chicken to pasta ratio. Um, normally, something like this, I sort of try to make sure I get one piece of chicken with a couple pieces of pasta on my spoon. Um, I got near the end and I actually had a whole lot more chicken left than I had pasta left, so um, it was a decent amount of, of chicken in there. Um, it had a decent enough flavor. I mean, it was edible. It wasn't horribly bad. Um, it was kind of bland. Uh, it might be better if I throw a little salt and pepper in there, um, but I typically don't don't have salt and pepper at my desk at work so I'd buy it again as an emergency item but I wouldn't buy it to, to work um, again I'd rather have my own chicken alfredo then there's the Coles Mexican tuna salad um, I was a little bit concerned about this because of the whole tuna and Mexican I didn't think it would go at all calories 230 fat 6 grams sodium 630 grams carbs 27 grams and protein 20 grams uh, this was actually pretty decent. Uh, large chunks of tuna, um, playing with them there. Um, pasta wasn't mushy. Uh, it had a good flavor overall. I'd buy these for an emergency stash in the pantry, most definitely. Um, and I might even have one every now and then. Uh, grab it, you know, when I'm running late in the morning, instead of putting my lunch together, just grabbing one of these and, and heading into work. <clears throat> And then finally, uh, last one was the Loma Linda Mediterranean Tomato and Olive. Uh, again, multiply all the nutritional values times two. So calories 256, fat 6 grams, sodium 970 milligrams, carbs 38 grams, protein 12 grams. Um, the pasta was mushy soft. Uh, there was a weird texture to the meat. The vegan meat, um, whatever it is that they used in that. Um, they were these tiny little, uh, uh, they were supposed to be little meatballs, but it looked like some sort of extruded pellet form of meat. It was bizarre, um, and it had a really weird texture. Um, the flavor was okay on this. I mean, it was like edible, um, but I would not buy it again, most definitely. Um, the sodium in this alone will kill you. 
Um, so yeah, I will not ever buy any more Loma Linda products. Won't even try them. I tried three. Look at the amount of oil in that. that that's just that's just insane. Um, so anyway, thanks very much for watching. Uh, hope this was useful for you. And uh, have a great day.